dive into the power of context with the concept of contextualization. This formidable tool helps us make sense of events, particularly those rooted in history. Contextualization is like a lens that allows us to see the why and how behind every event. It provides a backdrop, helping us understand why things happened the way they did and how they fit into the larger picture. But what happens when events occur simultaneously, each with its own unique context? Imagine trying to analyze a historical period where several crucial events are unfolding at the same time. Here, contextualization might not provide a complete understanding as it focuses on individual events rather than their interconnections. So while contextualization provides valuable insights, it may fall short when events overlap, giving us a fragmented view of the whole picture. This is where we need to broaden our perspective to see the forest for the trees. And that leads us to our next concept. When individual contexts blur into each other, a holistic view becomes essential. Just like a jigsaw puzzle, where each piece is significant, yet the entire picture only makes sense when they all come together, life's events often need a holistic view to be fully understood. This approach allows us to see the forest, and not just the trees, to comprehend the complete picture, and not just isolated parts. When events occur concurrently, they often create a complex web of interactions that individual contextualization might fall short of unraveling. Here, a holistic view shines by helping us grasp the interconnectedness and the overarching narrative of these simultaneous events. It's like looking at a tapestry. Each thread has its role, but it's the collective weaving that tells the story. Holistic view allows us to see beyond individual contexts but to connect these views, we need systems theory. Let's delve into that next. Systems theory, the lens that brings clarity to overlapping chronologies. As we delve into the realm of systems theory, imagine every chronology, every event, as an interconnected element within a larger system. Now, this might seem overwhelming at first, but let's break it down. Think about a puzzle. Each piece is an event with its own context. When we start placing these pieces against each other, we start to see a bigger picture. The same applies to systems theory. By viewing chronologies as interconnected elements, we can begin to understand the relationships between simultaneous events. Consider a historical revolution, the political unrest, the economic hardship, the social upheaval. These events are not isolated. They are interconnected elements that together led to the revolution. By applying systems theory, we can comprehend these complex relationships, even when they're happening all at once. Systems theory bridges the gaps, providing a comprehensive view of events, but how do we bring it all together? Now let's bring contextualization, holistic view and systems theory together for a comprehensive understanding. We've seen how contextualization helps us grasp the circumstances surrounding an event, but when multiple events occur at once, we need to employ a holistic view, this means seeing the whole picture, not just isolated parts. Systems theory comes in handy here. It allows us to see timelines as interconnected elements, forming a complex system. To achieve a holistic view, we have some practical tips. First, consider timelines as a system. This means recognizing that events are interconnected and influence one another. Next, identify relationships between different timelines. This could involve noticing cause and effect or patterns of behavior. Speaking of patterns, keep an eye out for recurring trends. These can provide valuable insights. Lastly, remain aware of your personal biases. They can cloud your judgment and skew your understanding. With these tools in hand, you're now equipped to view events with a more informed, comprehensive lens. 